Okay, so we're back. I did it. He I did it. Them. He had to go back and change the party. Why did you spoil it? Because they can tell. Because look who's not in the party. No, Sara's changed. To Glennon? Yeah, she is. Digivolved into Glennon. Yeah, now we have two Glennon. <laughs> two, two Glennon. It's, it's enough. Two Glennon. It's more than two enough. Two Glennon now, is now look, forever 13 enough. Star. 13 stars. Wow, Ooh, we can cuddles. do a whole whop, whopping nothing with them. Yeah, we can't do anything right. Actually, we are about to get our first summon. Eh. Spoiler alert. Eh. Is it the water dragon? Well, you don't get... You'll see. <laughs> get such strength! We are to be driven off our land once again! Oh, no, I can't handle it! Oh, trail it, dwarf tears! <laughs> oh, is there no land on this planet where we can live in peace? Oh, God, it's a fate! Why are we dealt such a hand? Last time we got a swoosh! Ah. This time it's a three of a kind! <laughs> I'll never eat chilies again! Are humans really the greatest species, species on, on this planet? These heretics of evolution! They're destroying the, these destroyers of the planet! <laughs> that great text. Oh, they died. Well, Dude, dramatic dwarf death. Oh, this is, uh... A theory? AIDS! There is a fairy over there! <laughs> now I made him Stallone. You're making him so retarded. <laughs> AIDS, is it alright? Is it a new party member? Ah, uh, who are you? I will be fine. The other fairies, are they alright? Oh, Lord! I don't feel damn poisons in the caves anymore. Oh, cuddles. cuddles. You're so tender. <laughs> I'm sure it's safe outside as well. Oh, I didn't. Okay. What? You're fucked up, man. We are sorry, but wait right here for a minute. We need to go further into that cave. It will only be a little while. Die calmly on the ground by yourself. Spoiler alert. Yeah. <laughs> See you, bitch. Uh, normally we would have recruited another fairy if we had opted to save SARS, but uh, we didn't get that fairy because uh. a fucking fairy. Are you ready? Oh, oh I'm shit. so ready. Yikes. Dude, remix. Welcome, son of man. Now come to me. You might want to add a little bass to that, though. Wait till you see this motherfucker. You're going to love his design. I love his design. He's like a fucking giant frog dragon. Dude. Don't spoil it. All right. Well, it's it doesn't matter. Look at look at how fucking awesome he is. Oh, what a cutie! Don't no need it, not to explain. I already know it. Don't seek it here. Oh man. There is not to be surprised about. I'm really sorry to all zero of our Jamaican viewers. <laughs> this isn't even Jamaican. Oh no, it's Indian. Yeah. yeah. My bad. All zero. It did but the driver. For we sleeping dragon who had dwelt <laughs> upon the island for an age. For an age? Mount Bayer and the land thou seekest is home to the fire dragon. Hello. <laughs> oh, unless thou quench it in a red place, it will provide a difficult journey. Provide. That don't care. Take this, son of man. My breath can breathe even boiling lava. Yes. Now I breathe on you. No, got, 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 it, don't ding the. Uh. Yes, Cuddles is going to receive the ice breath. Oh Cuddles my God, has he's been, been bestowed. He's the ice breath. <laughs> Take my the burden and as well. It'll be usual in holding back the fire dragon of mud fire. No one can understand what you're saying. They got That's okay. There's like text. It. Fortunately, see, we got our first. Oh Log shit! Frog Prince. It's the Disney movie. <laughs> oh, it's Frog Prince. Will that change the world, or will that change the gen? I have like all the bad Indian pop songs in the world stuck in my head right will now. Will that live on thy mother planet, or will that turn thy back on the planet and tread another path? Well, that's what this game's all about. What? I have no more lines in the whole game. Goodbye forever. That is not true. They said that they were chased out of the forest by the humans. No, yes. And they drifted down to our island, so the humans are to blame. Oh, nice transitive property, jackass. No, yes. Fucking fairy, stop it. No. <laughs> because of you humans, our village, our friends have been made victims. Yeah. Victim. Victim. Why can't humans live in harmony with nature? Tell them. 
Tell him, Pea Blossom. <laughs> Why do you continue to act the way you do, Pea Blossom? <laughs> Don't you see what the outcome of your choices will be in the future? Why? Why? Dude, thanks for layering the guilt on us. You yeah. By the way, shit. someone who doesn't give a shit cuddles. <laughs> cuddles. He's like, dum, 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 dum. <laughs> you crooks! I hate all of you wicked humans. Hurry up and get off this island. Okay, bye. She can't handle it, dude. Sars is break it down. A very sad tragedy triggered by the acts of humans. We have lost so many of our people and loved ones. Who cares? Although our village has you're right. <laughs> <laughs> blah blah genocide. Ro Ro blah, Rosetta's blah. like the only nice one. Well, aside from Razley, which is the one we'd be uh, recruiting uh, if we saved kid, but she's dead now. Up oh, flashback time. Look, it's characters from Chrono Trigger. Look, oh yeah, it is. Luca. Is that the only crossover between these two games? What do you mean? This? Oh, no, there's more than that. Oh. For sure. You'll see. Is it weird spike hair guy? What? No, that's the Lynx cat they've been talking about. Oh! That's not his hair. That's his, that's oh. His, believe it or not, that's his fucking hat. By the way, I think the CG is supposed to be a lot faster than this. It's just loading. Yeah. Meow! Isn't he kind of cool looking? Well, kind of a badass cat face. Yeah. If you're into furries. I... Okay. I see the implication. <laughs> I'm not a furry. Uh huh. Where am I? I fainted, eh? Okay, I definitely gotta give her some emotion here, not just PSA. Oh, voice. is this her own like special cutscene that she gets or whatever? Yeah. See, I put her in the party because I thought that was the only way to get this cutscene. You suck. <laughs> I'm pretty terrible. I know. I'm, I'm acting like I'm all professional about this. Sorry. Did I wake you? I had a bad dream. Wake who? All of Chrono Trigger was on fire. <laughs> Seeing that fairy's eyes filled with tears over losing her friends, that must have triggered memories of me own past. Is she a character in Chrono, Cro or Chrono Trigger? No, she's not. Well, god damn it. It's complicated, okay? Apparently. That's pretty much it. <clears throat> I was an orphan. I was abandoned when I was a baby. <laughs> You're a fucking asshole! <laughs> <laughs> you hear the tenderness of this music? I do. I chose to ignore it. There was someone who took me in and raised me as if I were her own little sister. I'm alive here today thanks to her and the wallabies. <laughs> and, and every single little wallaby. <laughs> and the aboriginals. <laughs> <laughs> right, it's the aboriginal wallabies. There were a lot of others left me in sister's place. <laughs> That's, my <laughs> That's my wallaby That's my wallaby I've never heard of wallaby before. Me either. Dude, we're so I do. I do actually own a pouch made of a tanned kangaroo scrotum. Would you wow. like to see it? Not right now. Maybe after this episode. I'm gonna show it to him. So basically, what we're getting at is that Lynx came by and he raided their house and burned it and kidnapped Sis. Oh no. Sister never came back because she was kidnapped. Now she's some weird cat cultist. <laughs> Welcome to Egypt, bitch. Since then, I've wandered the world just and experienced so much pain just to get boy. That's not how you live! That's not how you make your way through the world unless what? you're some, like, weird, masochistic, crazy Australian thief bitch. Guess what? That was oddly specific. <laughs> if you ask me, the ideas of guardian angels watching over us all the time, that's a load of rubbish. Well, that's a load of bollocks. She's an atheist and must be hung. In this game, <laughs> oh boy. In this world, I don't the, actually under think that. the underhanded always gets the last laugh. Only the ones who don't think anything of hurting others are the ones who get blood-stained fortunes. The ones who kill, the ones who devour, they're the ones who survive. That's the only rule of this world. Well, you have been just, like, rampantly murdering things. Yeah, she doesn't really feel that bad about it right No. Now. Yeah, she did get stabbed. Maybe Whatever. She's guilty. I mean, uh, how many people did she stab before that? She does. He wields a dagger, probably a lot. Yeah. Ha! Huh, don't make me laugh. Okay, I missed the part before that. But if that's how it is, that's fine with me. As so long as I'm alive, there ain't no going back. Okay, but so look, she's okay with stabbing people. Okay, I'll abide by this world's rules and I'll do what I gotta do, despite the rotten hand of cards I've been dealt. She didn't get a flush either. There are a whole lot of like card analogies that have just happened in the past like there are, ten minutes. There are characters that even use cards in this game as weapons. Well, I know. Like, like, they toss them like dart. Not Taishatsi. Uh, Zaushi. Zau Zaushi. 
It's a character in a Dynasty Warriors ah, game that does okay, that. Okay, because I thought you were just making noises and having like a sat- Satanist moment. Yeah, I have. <laughs> I do that. Oh, sometimes. by the way, we're over here now. Yeah. More importantly, Aqua Ball. Get in front. Thank you very much. Yeah. Sorry. Get the fuck out of here, AIDS. Glennon. Glennon. Dude, if I could not play as AIDS, I definitely would. You can do that actually in a new game plus. But, really? Uh, you can trade AIDS out? Yeah. He still has to appear on the field, but in battle you don't. Uh, you That's don't helpful. Yeah, it's, it's definitely cool because you can like explore other characters. Obviously, AIDS is like by, by far the best character in the game. He's got you know OP stats and since What the fuck? Get on a lily pad. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my fucking... There we go. Welcome to Ethan Fucks Up Part 2. No. <laughs> not fucking up this time. I'm All making right. nothing but good decisions and no mistakes. Alright. How to do it, man! By uh, the way, I'm really impressed that, you know, we are using an emulator, but we've done everything without using save states. We have not done a single save state yet, and we could have used it. We could have, we but we didn't. Oh, it's time for, uh... Huh? What is going on? The old boatman is gone. I, oh, I, said, I read it wrong. I thought it said goat man. Did he head back to the village because we were so wait? Oh, no. Here he is. Sly is back. I figured he'd be coming back, so I had the boat out. Are you all safe? Or I like, yes. Oh, many parties. It didn't look like you'd be coming back before sunset, and I had to return before it got dark. Well, since you made it back here, I can get you everything you needed to do. Or I bet you guys look a little gloomy if it was not so well. <laughs> Uh, what are you saying? <laughs> I don't know if I can find well, then let's head back to the village. Yes, let's head back to the village. Let's get the hell off of her, and then let's go back to the village. Wow, you said that four fucking times. Guilty fairy island. Let's Guilty leave this place. <laughs> that is funny. <laughs> oh, my Good. lord. By the way, when you were doing the, wa- the water dragon voice, I couldn't get that one song from Diddy Kong Racing out of my head from the Hot Top Volcano where it's like, I don't want to up right there. I haven't played that game in so long. That is the hardest racing game ever made. I could think of people that would challenge that notion, but and it is they quite can difficult. Get for... bent. Have you ever played a Gran Turismo game before? Yeah, and they're so boring. They are very dull. But they're I think so if you're gonna play it to boring. the same degree, they're pretty hard. They're That's so all. boring. That's no, all. dude. Diddy Kong Racing was straight up hard. Hard, hard, hard. It's brutal for a Nintendo game. Yeah, but... for... Compared to Mario Kart. Okay, Mario Kart is like a walk in the park. There's no, like, RPG-esque boss battles, you know? Like, it's like whiz Oh, yeah, there I mean. are in Diddy Kong Racing. I forgot about that. It's nonsense. You shouldn't need to do that, Mario. It's... Well, I mean, it's a cool idea. Don't get me wrong. It is a cool idea. It's not perfectly executed, but it doesn't matter. Yeah. <gasps> Woo! Excuse me. I got fucking... Hip-ups. Yes. He's got the hip-hops. I got the because <laughs> it's only dancing. Cause it's always bopping and booping, bopping the boopy, and booping the bopping. Wait, hold on. Can I? I think I can. You can't. Look at that. Just pass through it. Why Wasn't can't able you to pass do that. through it. Uh, cause I already cleared it. You can do that oh. with a lot of places that have uh, two, like a from the back. We're gonna go meet the uh, Scottish blacksmith. By the way. Ah. Are you excited? Great. <laughs> Oh, my Are you excited to meet Zappa oh. and his wife, Zippa? I'm not kidding. Are you serious? <laughs> Zappa and Zippa. Jesus Christ. I hope you're able to contain yourself on I, this. I hope I'm able to contain you. See, when I see Zappa and swords, I just think of that one character from Guilty Gear, Zappa. Well, go ahead. Welcome! There's the official blacksmith of the Acacia Dragoons! We're carrying only the best goods! Come and take a look! Now we're gonna make some weapons. <laughs> Alright, we need. Steel Swallow. Sure, How steel doesn't stick. We only have one Ooh. piece of iron? Damn, that's gonna be a problem. Iron. Can you buy iron? What is. Laddle Fee 26? Uh, that's. For some reason. Hold on. That's, uh, the name of. Holy shit, Steel sh- Hold on, I'm gonna mute the music right now. It's totally spazzing out on us. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I don't need the steel. What? Who has that shit equipped? Oh, I see. Alright, watch this shit. Do you know about this? There's an amazing material. Doesn't matter, we've got too much to go through. We're probably gonna have to hear it. You must be kidding me. Okay, there we go. So watch this shit. Okay! Watch it. You want to go to Burnhild? No. Wait, who has the iron shot then? Oh, it's, it's... 
it's a uh, bra. 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 Oh my god, dude. Dude, bra. Wow, I actually can't unequip it. That sucks, dude. I want penis winkle. I really, really, really want to unequip it from him so I can make more items. Well, buy like a shitty item, give it to him, and then it's so backwards. Man. All right, man. Now people have to watch. Fucking Menu Fighter 4. Menu Fighter. Well, let's just talk about... Stuff? Blacksmiths in video games. Right. Let's talk about... Let's talk about crafting mechanics in video games. Okay. Because I think crafting in video games is a waste of fucking time. Is it? Yes. Because you're just gonna find the items anyway, playing the goddamn game. But I like it. And sometimes you don't do that. Sometimes you're, you make unique weapons from... Are you fucking kidding me? Did I buy the wrong... Wrong. Good job. So why are there like Q29? Is that like a... I don't know. Fuck you. That's my answer. I'm pissed off. No, it's alright. We're gonna find a way around it. Watch this shit. We can disassemble some shit. I have, a, I have a plan. Okay, this has iron in it. We have to kill Bra. No, I don't wanna. I kinda do. But I don't actually think we have a problem. I know we have like two sight scopes, so we'll unequip those. Iron nail? I think someone has this. Eh, okay. Um, Scaly dress. Yeah. Oh, really? Yeah, fuck it. I don't care. We need more iron. Alright. I need more iron. See, okay, okay. Let's. Okay, okay. I know you haven't played this game, but. Tell me about it. In Skyrim, uh -huh. right? Uh -huh. People talk about uh -huh. how much they smithed for hours and hours and hours. Oh, I made this. Incredible fucking dragon oh, tit is... sword, and I'm like, dude, go you. I played the game, had a great time just being my character and immersing myself in the world, and found it anyway at an appropriate point in the game. Okay. And I had more fun, because I'm not sitting there watching a pre-rendered script, script of somebody bang a hammer on an anvil for four hours. Yeah, that's cool, dude. Sorry. No, it's fine. I just don't like crafting in games. I think it's so boring. It's your fault for talking to people about Skyrim. Fair point. <laughs> Fair point. I'm just keep it Fair a real point. Dude. All right, let's let's see if I do this right this time. Bro. Okay, this is. I want the steel shot for later because there's another character we're gonna get later that uses it. Okay. And we might not. Well, no spoilers, but we might not have access to some of our. Oh, own. the iron glove. Oh, the iron glove. Okay, you don't need the sight scope. You need the silver loop. Let me get an antioxidant cap. Antioxidant. Oh, right. I forgot to give him steel sword. Steel, steel sword. sword. Gle no, no. Glennon. No, 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 no. Dude, we can't fucking stop making uh, Chris Kreger jokes. He's just so funny. AIDS. 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 <laughs> okay. A little story behind AIDS. AIDS. Uh. When I played Persona, I every time I play an RPG, I'll start with this. Or play DDR, or play a lot any of things, number of except games. Except for fighting games. I named myself AIDS with this. This is Zappa, by the way. Take your business up the counter, Ken! Okay, that's all you got for now. By the way, Cuddle's new name? Ken. Ken. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so anyway, yeah, any especially... Is that a corgi? It's a corgi. Oh my... <laughs> um, anytime that I play, especially in RPG and sometimes other games, I'll name my main character AIDS with a Z. There's a long story behind that. We're not going to get into it. When I played Persona 4 for the first time, I'm, you know, innocuously all setting up. They ask you, so what is your name? I put in AIDS, capital A-I-D-Z. That's the end of it. And then they say, what is your surname? And I freeze. <laughs> I'm like... <laughs> Her name? <laughs> I, didn't, I didn't think that far ahead, man. So I panicked and I put AIDS again. <laughs> and my name was AIDS AIDS for the rest of the whole thing. God, what an unfortunate name. It's, I mean, you could come up with a lot worse names than that, like you Scranton can. Feel Hold. Poop Dollar. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> like, it just, it doesn't end. Electro so Jolt. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I know you're getting the hang of it. Bush Basher. <laughs> you know, I've, I've bashed plenty of bushes in my time. I forgot to get some green stuff. It's actually lying. 
Oh, there's heal all in here? Yo. Yo. Yo, ah. Yo. Video game. Yo, Gabba Gabba. <laughs> I've never seen that show, but it Me looks either. fucking hilarious. It looks really weird. It's a weird kids show. We need more of those. The fucking uh, Futurama episode of that is really funny. They did an, a show about it? Yeah, they did an episode about it. Interesting. Yeah. Oh, I need, I'm going to need ointment because we're going to the fireplace. Oh, ointment, ointment for that burn. Oh, ointment. I hate that word. <laughs> it's pretty gross. Oh, Merelda, I need you to come and rub some oh, ointment God. on my corns. Oh, my corns <laughs> and my bobkins. My uh, bobkins? <laughs> I just kind of made that one up. Oh, my bobkins. It's, oh, my bobkins. I've been toy. afflicted by, by John's bobkins oh, for 20 years. Oh, what? John's bobkins. It's a really unfortunate disease. Oh, the illness is just so unpleasant, buddy. <laughs> the illnesses just keep piling up. Oh, God. When you get to my age... 463. <laughs> when I was a little girl, America was just an idea. Yeah, it was the, the semen building up in the balls of George Washington. I'll tell you, he also <laughs> had wooden balls. George Washington, now he was a good lay. Oh, good Not that one. I knew that firsthand. My mother was the one that slept with him on occasion. She loved the wooden teeth all up in her... Oh, she just couldn't get enough of it, and there were splinters. Oh, God, and, shit. And, and then on the next episode of Goofs Unlimited... On the next episode of Goofs Unlimited, we're we... going to talk more about George Washington as a lover, and also the effects of fire on, uh, on jaundice. Or not.